We all lived here and we all, for the most part, planned to stay here for a while, so we really just wanted something cool to happen and we weren't willing to wait around for it to just fall in our lap. So we brought our community together and decided to build something from scratch just the way we wanted it to be. And we've always been 100% independent. We've never had any sort of agencies or boundaries or rules or anything because in the end, we were just a bunch of kids doing things on our own terms. This event wouldn't be what it is without the people who work behind the scenes for months at a time or the people who show up and just, just give their all to make the best event experience they possibly can throughout the weekend. So when we were starting SAS Fashion Week, we really recruited our team from two totally different worlds. Uh, there was one side that was very experienced in the creative and interested in rebellion, and there was another side that we recruited totally from the corporate and business uh, world. So these two sides were constantly learning from each other and stretching each other, I mean sometimes painstakingly. and. Uh, this really was seen in the evolution of the event over the years as we were kind of growing in all these different directions. It unearthed like a lot of creative talent that we didn't know that we had. I feel like it just, we've had this talent and we've had these people here all along and it just really helped us like utilize them and, and really introduce them and expose all these, these wonderful people that we have. I think that SAS Fashion Week has benefited the province because it's gotten so many more people involved in the fashion industry. I guess I'm, I'm happy and I'm sad that this is the last year of Fashion Week. Um, I'm happy because I'm just so unbelievably grateful for everything that they've been able to provide me with and um, everything that I've, I've gotten from it. And yeah, I'm sad because I look forward to this event every year. Um, and now I guess I'm just gonna have to put forth a little more effort to, to hang out with all these people and make new cool projects, hopefully. <laughs> My career would be very different without Fashion Week. I maybe wouldn't have met the 22 Fresh crew and I probably wouldn't be where I am today. I'm very fortunate. It's been such a great run. It's been a lot of fun. Um, it's been a lot of work. So it's really bittersweet, um, but it's exciting because I think a lot of us are excited to see what's going to come next. And we hope that the event inspires you know, the next creators and, and innovators and entrepreneurs to, to do what they want to do in, in Saskatchewan. And yeah, we're just really excited to see what comes next. Yeah, and I just hope that all of the hard work that everyone put into SAS Fashion Week uh, inspires others to go out and uh, try something themselves. It doesn't matter what kind of experience or age you're at. Um, just walk into it with confidence and intent and no one will doubt you.